Please don't tell me that I have to do like one more route. That'd be really annoying if that's the case. I'm going to save now, just in case there isn't one when I head down there. How close is the... Yeah. And then we shall take on the final boss in Titan's Trials and hopefully I can wrap up this session. It's probably going to be fairly similar in style to what I just did now, but... That's going to be quite a common theme, just having a strong sentinel to really tank most of the attacks while you go to work and chip away HP. Because once the HP goes over a certain threshold, it starts to get really difficult. You just have to chip away, you don't have much choice. Okay, so I did uh, all of the missions up to number 50, but once you do that, you have to kind of start one more little run-through of Titan's Trials. And when you get to the E category, then you'll be able to unlock mission 51. So, here we go. Atticus the Soulless. It's going to be the toughest seek boss battle yet. Let's do it. Been a long time since I defeated this guy. Pretty sure it's a case of physical protection with this one once again. So let me set up. A little bit of Crystarium to do. It's pretty good near the 10,000 mark. That's not too bad at all. Okay. Physical 38%. Mm. Let's make that 51, why not? Probably doesn't need a clay ring. Her physical is 28, it's a little bit weak. I mean, it's going to be Snow taking most of the, the punishment here, so she doesn't need to have anything particularly incredible, but still. Um, I feel like giving her this, but... You know what, we'll keep it as it is here, but we'll just change this. Oh, we have a second one of these. Okay. I mean, outside of physical, I don't remember anything that he does here, so... I guess we'll give him ribbon, perhaps. That could help. Okay. Now... Let's see. Okay, let's just see what's going to happen here. Because he has a shitload of HP, so it's going to take a little while to, to wear it all down, but I think we can do this. I've done it with much lower stats, so I should be able to do it now. But back then I was playing this game a lot. Okay, he's made his little badass entrance at sea. How are we gonna do here? Keep a cool head and we'll nail this. You're asking for it. This, this guy gets progressively more and more difficult, so he's not too bad at the start, but he gets really difficult near the end. He's pretty quick. 
Yeah, let's give him a lever scope. Speed things up here. Alright, let's see what's going on here. He's resistant to magic, halves, physical, and he has some um, immunities. He's got 9.1 million HP, which is no fun at all. But Snow is going to pretty much be taking him on because he's, he's going to keep provoking him and shielding pretty much. If we can just deprotect and then slow him down, that'd be nice. Okay. Slow would be good. Once we've got slow on there, it's time to go on the offensive, but... Okay. Basically, you want to build that chain gauge as soon as possible. Because you pretty much can't stagger this guy. So, you might as well bring it up as high as you can. And then just... Uh, and then do the damage. Just chip away at him. I think when he drops below certain thresholds, he gets more and more stronger, so the earlier you build the, you build the chain gauge, the easier it's going to be in the long run, I think. So That's why, for now, I'm not going to wor worry too much about healing. I'm just going to work the gauge as much as I can. If he picks on Vanille, it's going to be a bit of a problem. But his chain resistance is pretty solid, so... Still gonna take a while. You see, even when he's slowed, he's uh, he's pretty relentless. Should give Vanille ample time to heal. Okay, let's keep at it. Alright, cool. Let's go again. It all seems very easy so far, but just wait till it gets to like below 50% or 25% HP. I mean, in this battle, it might be better to have Hope instead of Vanille, so that you can have haste and stuff as well. But we're doing okay. I'm just going to be patient with this. Get the chain to maybe 400-ish before I start getting a bit more offensive. Because you don't need to get it all the way to, like, 900 or whatever. Because later on I'm going to have a lot less time to attack, I'm going to have to be defensive a lot more often, so then when the chain gauge is really high, even though I don't attack very often, I'm still going to be able to get the damage in that I need. Dishing out punishment indiscriminately for me. Work for me. Once my buffs run out and his debuffs run out, that's going to be when I'm going to switch up. Because we're okay for now. Alright, 
Alright, gonna go for it. I don't want to let it run out though. But you can see it moves around a lot as well, which makes it a little bit difficult. But we're almost there. We're almost ready to get going. So you can see Snow just absorbing that, that punishment. Don't get predictable. What a pain. <laughs> Appreciate it. Time for a change. Okay. Almost ready. Eighty-seven thousand. All right, let's go. Let's attack it. See, even though I'm taking 50,000 chunks away from him, he's not making an incredible amount of difference. That's how much HP that thing has. Okay, so here comes upgrade number one. Time's going to come when all I'm going to have is solidarity, pretty much. Vanille could die here. Oh, okay. Wasn't that bad at all. Okay. But that attack is going to get progressively stronger and stronger. So... By the end, it's going to be very difficult to survive. Okay, let's keep going. amazing when an enemy has this much HP even when you're doing this much damage. Time for a change. I gotta do everything. Everything runs out so quickly. Okay, let's get this slow and deep attack back on before we move on to the next stage. Okay, do protect is being refreshed. Ah, when he concentrates, he removes those buffs. Which is not ideal. Okay, ah, oh, shit, wrong one. Let's go. My first hit is doing maximum damage now. Come on guys, keep at it. He's doing the whole final boss of Final Fantasy X thing. It's going to remove his debuffs. Try that on me. Anytime. Oh shit, maybe not. That was the powerful attack that he was preparing. I wasn't ready for that. Let's heat things up. I thought that was something to remove debuffs. I was wrong. My bad. Try that on me. Oh, 
So like I said, we laid the groundwork early, made sure that we built the chain gauge high, and now we're reaping the rewards. Shit, I've got to still guard this or I might die. Okay. I was ready for you, son. Although I did get slowed, which isn't great. Let me get Deep Attack back on. Okay. Should be able to put the final touches here. So it's now. Even without Braver, I'm still doing a fair bit of damage. It's amazing how, what you can do when you prepare early and you take your precautions. Who's going to deal the final blow? It's going to be me. So. That made him look very easy, but he's actually much tougher. But my stats were pretty good, so that made my life a lot easier. So there you go. That is Titan's Trials done. And another Genji Club, which I haven't really been able to use yet. won the approval of the big guy. Okay. We're done. Whew. So that took a few hours, but it wasn't as bad as I was expecting, to be honest. If anything, the, the Racket of Egypt and the Neo True are the two hardest battles.